They've got a bag of food. Yeah. You're starving hungry. How are you doing, Russia? Are you all right? How are you? Hmm? You having a sleep in your basket? Obviously, do a spag ball or something like that. And it's coming like a... Any pie? Any pork pies? <laughs> um, um, by the looks of them, uh, to hold up, hold up now with our buyers' side of things. And bearing in mind that they could still pull out just a bit. What's a Christmas. Start of a new vlog, but not really start of a new day. What are we, what are we, what are we off to, Lee? Charcoal? Yeah. Charcoal paint in Altrincham. Been around for many, 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 many years. Used to be one in sale, one in hail. And we're going to, I think we're having a Bonanza burger, yeah? It's like a double quarter pounder with cheese. I think Sally's going to have a prairie dog. Um, and this will probably be my last ever Bonanza burger. Lee. Nutsford Fair, do you remember coming to the May Day Fair? Do you remember? Do you, do you remember what happened there once with all them girls? Yeah. What happened? I recognise you. And they all came running after us, didn't they? Do you remember? Guy, yeah. blimey, Charlie. Right, so um, this is an amazing engine, actually. A really good engine. If you know Altrincham, this is the one and only charcoal pit. So we're going to um, dive in, I think, and grab ourselves a burger. Burger time, Lee. Starving. What about you? Uh, hungry. Really hungry. It's too... Um, Two takeaways in two nights here for yourself, innit? Yeah. Pizza last night, how was that? Good. Well then, how's it gonna be? That is the question. You've got a bag of food. Yeah. You're starving hungry. <sighs> Who's hungrier, you or me? Nighty ho, let's get going. Oh. Probably, probably, but maybe not, my last ever Bonanza burger. How big is your sausage? Oh, Russia. How big is your sausage burger? Hold it up. Look at that. Great, can I eat it now? You certainly can. I'm chomping through mine. And Russia's going to be excited. Please just give him Russia a bit of burger, will you? Hmm? Not a million days until we go back to the nursery, so... How are you doing, Russia? Are you all right? How are you? Hmm? You having a sleep in your basket? You being a good girl? I'm going to nip over to my favourite shop, uh, Lidl, or is it Lidl? And probably, probably, this will be my, probably, last home shop. Um, so I'm just going to go and stock up for things, and then the next time I actually go to, for a Lidl shop will be... Uh, to go ready to go to the nurseries. One, one thing that was quite interesting over the last few months, so I keep mentioning blah, 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 blah. It's, it's a nightmare being a campsite warden, especially a solo warden, trying to eat because it's very difficult to, to, to cook food without being disturbed and blah, 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 blah. So I pretty well live on ready meals when I'm on my own. And my belly, as you can't see here, um last year oh no, it's gonna, i'm only slim i'm only skinny but I, i'd end up with the right belly and it's definitely processed crap food that was um doing that and obviously since i've been home because i'm cooking fresh proper decent food virtually every night we have had a couple of cheeky takeaways this last week but um yeah you can see the difference it it, it actually does to um your metabolism so yeah a bit of a nightmare back to living on Ready meals, processed food, crap. But hey ho, that's the way the mop flops. I need to get in the car. I've got, I've also need to get a tire checked as well. I've got a very, 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 very slow uh, leak on a tire. It's possibly a valve or something. So I need to get into um, get that checked out before I go away. So let's get outside. It's not raining. The sun's out, and it's blue sky, and it's relatively mild. It never rains in Manchester. Well, it does on a Monday, sometimes a Tuesday, occasionally on a Thursday. Uh, there's something a bit strange going on here. So it's got some mint. And obviously do a spag ball or something like that. And it's coming like a... 
Something like a shrink wrap instead of the usual container. Um, it says here, same great product but fresher for longer. What do you think about that then? Interesting. The random side. Look at the state of some of this stuff here. Oh dear. Marshmallow hoops to hot dogs. Chili sauces. To Jaffa cakes. <laughs> to Coca Cola. To coffee. To leftovers from Christmas. never know what you're going to come out with when you come shopping at Lidl. You just never, never know. Right, that's that over done with. Um, very quiet. Super weird. Like, really quiet. I mean, that's the car park. Uh, not that, no idea what's going on. Why it's so quiet. Where, where is everybody? <sighs> Goodness me. Right. Let's hit the road again. Carry on, brother John. Carry on. And another thing as well, since I came home from the nurseries last year, I've not had any pie, any pork pies. <laughs> um, those that watch my vlog will know that just because I need just to grab something just to put into my belly quite often, I survive daytime on pork pies. <laughs> I'm not at a pork pie in was it November, November, December, January, February, three, three, three and a half months without a pork pie. Goodness me. It's a very, very nice day. It's a real elephant, 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 element of spring in the air. Be lambing season soon, won't it? All the little lambs on the fields. Popped into an ATS and um, managed to get seen to straight away. Gets the car into the bay. It's Say, fingers crossed it's going to be a valve. Will they try to flog me a new tyre? That's going to be the question. You know what these places are like. So I'm in Broadheath. Screw fix there. There's a gym over here that tried to open up during lockdown and got in the news for um, not complying. A very, very naughty gym. Right, so a sort of result, but not a result. So this tyre, I've got a very, 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 very slow puncture and it turns out it's actually uh, a slight damage on the rim so um yeah to give credit where credit due the lads there at ats were absolutely brilliant really good not charged anything so um looking for a 16 inch honda civic a rim at the moment so there's a couple on marketplace i've just sent some uh an inquiry over and pick up a uh, yeah a new rim fun and games but hey ho that's the way the cookie crumbles. Right, so dilemma with these wheels. So I've managed to find somebody who had some alloys for the Civic for sale in a place called Crumstall, which is it's about 40 minutes drive from where we live. Anyway, I've just been over and I've picked up a full set of alloys because uh, this didn't have a, a spare with it. So in here, these are pretty mint um, by the looks of them. Uh, tight tyres, one of them tyres is okay, but I can get everything all swapped over and I got the entire lot for 50 quid. <laughs> so even, even scrap, um, is they're, they're almost worth that on the um, on it now. So I was going to go and get this done and sorted, but unfortunately I've got some other things going on that I need to sort out at home. So it's going to have to wait until tomorrow. Technical issues, tech, tech, techie things are going very wrong in the last few days, haven't they? I'm not going to get into detail on what we're trying to get working that was working, that isn't working, but should be working, but I bought a new one because the other one wasn't working, that could get a new one working, and the new one's not working. Do me head in. That's another hour of my life this afternoon. These things are sent to try us, do you? Oh, well. I ended up in flipping crumbsel. Another hour and a half of my life lost. Mm. But you commented, so sorry, we're running we're running a few days behind with our vlogs as ever. Only a couple of weeks and I'm back in the nurseries. Something like that. Yeah. <laughs> and, for, and at the beginning of this vlog, I commented how quiet Lidl's was this morning. I was in there about half 10, 11. It was dead. 
really quiet. But I forgot, it's half oh, term, isn't it? Yeah, so I jumped in my car, all psyched up for an hour and a half, stuck in traffic. And there wasn't much at all. And I was actually half an hour early for work. Yeah. So and I got home quicker as well. So there you go. Just a bonus. Half term. Well, fingers crossed, this will be the... Fingers crossed, we'll speak in a minute about it, but this will be the very last February half-term commute in Manchester ever. To be honest, it's hard. Okay. I live in Hope, but I had to pop out, make a couple of phone calls this afternoon because I can't, I'm not allowed to use the phone in my work and there's no phone signal unless you go right outside. There's like massive great building blocks all the phone signal anyway. It's freezing today, so I'm there freezing my toes off, I'm trying to sort out one or two things. Mm, so anyway, we'll have a we'll have um, a a, li- a little update, a little update in a minute. But just so, before we forget, oh, yeah, yes. before we forget, that's a, we'll give an update mm. on the house and everything, um, which I was hoping. Well, I'm still. Well, I'll come to that in a minute. Anyway, right, Bonnie, 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 bon, bon, Bonnie, has sent over a coffee, Sandra. Hello, Bonnie. Hello, Bonnie, and your other half, Bonnie. So okay, I get vo- I guess get voice notes and we correspond on the internet, right? With anyway. the things, so we need to give a big shout out to John Beer. Hello, John Beer. 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 John beer. Beer. Hello. Beer. We want more beer. All oh, the lads are cheering. Get the ginger beer in. Those that know that song will know. And also, Bonnie says we need to give a big shout out to Desmond. Desmond. Hey. Who is 96. Wow. Older than your mother. 96. Younger than John. Hey, Joan. And uh, Desmond's gone up this week. So I hope it all goes well. And uh, yeah. Hope everything goes well, Desmond. All the best. Yeah. Hope the operation. Sorry, th- this will be out probably after you've had the op. Because um, we're running a couple of days behind. But I hope it goes well, Desmond. And also to John. Beer, beer. We want more beer. Big hello to you as well. Hey up, we're the map lads. Da 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 We like chips and gravy, and now we'll take his place. So don't you, we lads, or we'll smack your face. Here he comes. Sorry, Sandra, what you got in your hand? You seem to be a bit in another world, Neil. Again, I've got a headache today. I've just had a real. I've just actually got. I've physically got. I don't do headaches, and I've actually got a headache. Anyway, Bonnie also said. I assume it's Bonnie also said. Give a big fuss to Russia. Oh yeah, we always give a big fuss to Russia. Russia knows something is going on. She's seen all the bags and boxes and things. She knows something's going on. Anyway. Anyway. Yeah. So while I've been waiting, I've been trying out something new. I've never used circular needles before. You never so, used what? Circular needles before. A cir- what's a circular needle? I don't even know what a circular needle so is. So it's work in progress, but it's got to be another hat. And also not quite nice colours, I think. So, oh. so circular needles is you, once it's joined up, we just keep sewing, well, knitting, I should say, round and round and round. So, and you said... Oh, knitting needles, not needles, sewing circular needles. Circular knitting needles, circular knitting needles. I've not got a clue what's going on here. So, How many hats do you need? Well, no, no, this is, this is for me. This is going to stab you with hats? I'm not going to stab you with anything. So I like I like the other hats I was making, but they take a very they long might, time to make. Like little this, chopsticks. This might be a little bit of um, a sideline eventually. What do you reckon, people? Yeah, but it's taking you six weeks to get that far. You're not going to make much, are you? No, it hasn't taken me six weeks oh, at all. Well, you've been sat on that city every night you're getting from work. You sit there and you spend an hour. Not that long. So, anyway, new hats. So, I'm, I'm quite into these. So I've never used circular needles before. So, how can you be into them? Because so, well, it's a new thing. Let's keep me amused while we're waiting for everything else to happen. Right, so on on things on things happening. So right, we're one step forward and three steps backwards, aren't we? We're still we're mm-hmm. still can't so, press any buttons. So things are progressing, but we're not over the line yet, are we? So we've mainly got to hold up hold up now with our buyers side of things. And bearing in mind that they could still pull out, which is going to really 
piss me right off if that happens. But you've got to be prepared for the worst and, and hope, hope for the best. For the best. But we've wait, we've got. So, I think we've explained. We've got a portal. And it's got like little traffic lights on it, and we're just waiting for one red light to go green. And then once that red light has gone green, it's going to be a bit of a domino. All being well, things will progress. But as far as the buyer side of things go, we're, we've got paperwork coming this week, haven't we? What well, us as buyers? Yeah, yeah, our side, our, our Lincolnshire yeah. property. Yeah, yes. Yeah. So we need to review that information. So that needs so. to be here before I go back to Lincolnshire. Um, because we've both got to sign it it's got to be witnessed again so which I promised it will be yeah so uh, So. more more stress and everything what else do we have oh yeah we've got a very small um, mortgage as well so we've had notification now from our building society what all that's all about and we would tentatively but it's not an exact date given a date of the 29th of February it's a leap year I can I could, I could propose to you, Sandra. Again? Well, I'm not going to say I'm going to. I said I could. I'm not going to. I know it's the other way around. It's the woman proposing to the male, isn't it? I'm leave you, isn't it? Again? You never proposed to me, ever. You shrunk again. <laughs> right, and I've done what I think will probably be the last shop for here at home. My next shop will probably be my provisions to take to the nurseries. I'm saying that I, when I came back, I had quite a little pot belly dinta. And since I've been e- eating properly, eat, eating thing, my belly bulge has gone down from not eating all the processed food. I'm not as big as your belly. Leave me alone. Don't, <laughs> don't start. I'm not claiming to have lost much weight, dear. No, well, I, I, I have. But it's all that. But it's all the processed it's just, food. Just sat at my desk all day. It's not helping. No, oh, well, I'll be well. You'll soon be out pushing your mother in a wheelchair, getting in that easterly breeze by the Lincolnshire coast. <sighs> Very soon, all being well. <laughs> what else has gone on today? What else has happened today? Here? Your rims. Oh, I explained about my rims. About yeah, your, your yeah. Rims. So I was I was going to go back into Broadheath to get that sorted out this afternoon, but it was half three quarters of four, and unbeknown to me, I'm going. I'm not going to help the schools. Schools are out. <laughs> so fingers fingers crossed, I'll get the tyres changed and the new rims on and everything sorted out tomorrow. All being well. Yeah, uh, Trafford schools seem to be off, but Manchester schools seem to be in. So I don't know how that works, but it was still a lot quieter. Anyway. It is indeed. Right, okay, okay. Right, I think I think we'll we'll wrap off. I just thought I'd bring you on to the end of this one. This started. Oh, how was your prairie dog? It's nice. What? It was nice. Oh, what's the prairie dog? What's the prairie dog? So at the beginning of the video, I showed you prairie dog. Oh, well, it's well, just went, like a. You went. Let me eat it. I was really hungry. <laughs> it's like a giant frankfurter in a bun, really. And then I had some salad from the day before. A few chips with it, it's nice. And chips, yeah, it was all right, yeah. My, my, my bonanza burger was good, I really enjoyed it. And a nice pasta italian stuff today, used mm-hmm. up an old pack of ham, the old bacon, some mushrooms, some pasta sauce, and stuff. That was very nice, pasta, pasta for tea. I've made some sausage rolls to take to work this week, but Neil doesn't want to show you them because I don't know quite why. Should we have a look at your sausage rolls before we go? Go on, go and get your sausage rolls and then we'll say goodbye, Sam. <laughs> Why do you, why do you want to get why do why do why do anyway coming up if you just hold on one moment we've got Sandra's sausage rolls you left the door open Sandra no, right the dog did right left uh, you, leave it for no, now. where are they oh oh Ooh. sausage rolls so there was a reason why I did it which was well I needed something for my lunches. And then I remembered we had had a roll of puff pastry, which I thought might be out of date by now. Just a bit. <laughs> Christmas. 
So I thought, well, so I'll buy some sausage meat and some short crust pastry and try making short crust ones this time. So Rash is very excited. Rash thinks they smell great. When we did when we did that nineteen seventies meal, that's almost getting on to two months ago. It only feels like a couple of weeks ago, doesn't it? Time flies, Neil. Hmm. So, so I got some yeah sausages with the sausage meat in. Got the sausage meat out. Made our own sausage rolls. Right. And that'll be my lunches this week. Marvellous. I'll say goodbye now then. Bye. Okay. okay so I'll put that down. And I'll, I need I need to turn the camera off. So <laughs> <laughs> remember everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Stay tuned in for another video coming your way. We don't know from where, we don't know when, and we don't know what's going to be in it. But coming soon, another vlog from the Campsite Warden. Mm -hmm.